skippers. Well, just looking at a card in recent weeks. She won the Manchester City Centre race. Three weeks or so back, a windy 1094, then one in Henglo in 2202. Very quick in front of the home crowd. Again, in far from ideal conditions. But she goes in five. The lineup from the inside, running in one. Williams in two. Lala Vicolio three. Facey in four. Skips in five in the blue. Thompson in six. Now watch Thompson. Oliveira Santos seven. Hyacinth in lane eight. Good start there from Skippers. One of the best starts I've seen him produce for a while. Inside of face, he also going well, but Skippers up on the field already and already up on the shoulder of Elaine Thompson after about 70 metres and into the straight has a good lead. Now watch the clock. If it was warmer night, this would be special. She's going away with every stride. Outsider, Thompson, is going to be well beaten here, although she'll take second place. Tipping out of line, 21.94. Well, the meeting record by Gwen Torrance, 21.94, and it's 21.95 from skippers will that be confirmed or rounded down it goes back to 1994 Gwen Torrance's meeting record they'll be looking at that photo finish <laughs> very very carefully indeed that was a real exhibition run from the skippers who had a fabulous start it's I said earlier it's been her Achilles heel from one race to another Certainly, uh, even when she's won, she's had to work hard to come from behind. 21.93. It is a new Diamond League record, a meeting record, and a world-leading time for Daphne Skippers there. And in these conditions, too, the wind plus 0.7 behind her in cold, cold conditions. That is special. Yeah, transition was fabulous from the bend. She had a great bend, as you said. Transition was superb. And that was a powerful piece of 200-meter running. That is really world class at his very best. He applauds herself as she goes sub-22. Have a little look at the start. Certainly she went right up onto Elaine Thompson and Thompson is good. She's world-class and she made her look ordinary on this occasion. So powerful on the bend. Look at the relaxed look on that face. Great bend, super transition, powerhouse down the straight and into an alone finish. Look at that, there's no one else in the shot. 21.93. Fabulous stuff. Just three tenths slower than she ran in the World Championship final last year. 21.63. She is class. Former heptathlete, turn sprinter, and my goodness me, she is going to take some beating. Wonderful, wonderful event and a great performance. Well, Skippers wins in 21.93. She was beaten by Tori Bowie in Eugene, who ran 21.99. But now she's top of the heap. Thompson second.